Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to another episode of City Bus Manager. Back in Tarvin today, where the event in the city is, uh, I mean we've got a whole 51 minutes of the event in the city, so uh, that's going to be over soon, so everything will return to normal. It'll be really interesting to see, uh, obviously Saturday there'll be less of the bus service anyway, but if we go up here, we've had a hell of a lot of passengers using our new 136 and 137 routes. Um, so yeah, it'll be interesting to see whether the passengers actually keep on with that, or if it sort of drops to a more uh, not easy to deal with amount of passengers. Now, uh, in the last episode, I did buy a lot of new Enviro 400 MMCs for Liverpool, so it might still be worth having a look, seeing if we can put a few more routes in that sort of go to these uncovered areas. Now, I know that we've been spending a lot of time in Liverpool, however, there's, there's just a lot to do, isn't there? I mean, what I might like to do, I mean, look at that, that's a nice little, could terminate there, couldn't we? That's actually, do you know what, we're going to put that in now. We're going to do it straight away. Don't just talk about it, Joe, get it done. Right, so this will be the 138 kick things off with a new route. Why not? Right, Queen's Square bus station. Now, how in uh, how on earth are we getting there? So, we will go up. Go up here. There we go. Nice and straightforward. I don't want to sort of jinx things here, but I do feel like the, uh, the route builder, or the route creator, has been a little bit more responsive uh, than it has been recently. You know, particularly when you get to uh, later later game, it does sort of, yeah, it just feels like it's been a little bit better. Am I, am I the only one that thinks that? We're going to carry on down here, look at that, right, Picton Road. So this is obviously Edge Hill Station, is it? No, Edge Hill Station's, what's that? There, there's Edge Hill Station. And keep going down here, lovely. Down through this area here, I've got no idea, well, I know where we are, because I can see on the map, but, uh, right, that's, that's there, lovely. Uh, are we carrying on straight down? No, we're going... Yes, we want to go here. So we'll just carry on straight down this road. Lovely. There we go. Right, down to Waver Tree. Lovely. Put that on there. That's a nice little uh, blob of buildings, isn't it? I'm sure that's... Uh, right, I'll get them in there. That'll get them in. It's uh, good coverage, this, isn't it? Right, there we go. We'll have uh, another one of these. Is that... We go down there. Yeah, it's not one way. That's fine. I apologise in advance if you can hear the neighbour's child screaming in the garden. It's one of those things. It's a lovely uh, it's a lovely summer's day, so everyone's outside. It's not saying they're doing anything wrong, of course, but uh, obviously if, if the microphone's picking it up and you can hear screaming, it's, uh, yeah, it's not our house. It's not the barracks for a change. Uh, right, so we'll go up here. We'll go round, round this place. Get maximum coverage. Look at that. Get all round there. Go round the edge of here. Lovely. Oh, fantastic. Right, down here, wood lane. That's the wood lane terminus, but what I am going to do is we're going to go... There we go, wood lane terminus, round the edge here. Oh, what's what's going on there then? Right, we'll stick you there. Lovely. Go back up, wood lane. Yep, we'll stop there. And then we'll go down here just for maximum coverage. There we go. We'll go around that way. It can be a sort of loop around the end there. Back up there. Oh, fantastic. Right, we'll go this way around this housing estate now. There we go. Right, straight back up into Liverpool. Now, I reckon this is going to use Pulsar 2s. Pulsar 2s? I don't think we have Pulsar 2s. You know what I mean. I think we... Uh, right, there we go. Carry on down here. Yeah, lovely. Pulsar 1s. Pulsar 1s. That's all we've got, isn't it? Right, there we go. Straight back into... Uh, I'll have to sort of keep prodding uh, CW315 to make a Pulsar 2. And an Eclipse 2. That'd look good, wouldn't it? It'd look fantastic. Right, back up here. And then we can go straight down to Crown Street. Is that going to work? It is. Excellent. Right, Mount Pleasant. Yeah, lovely. Right, get that in. And then we'll, we'll stop there, because for some reason we always stop there. And we'll go around to the Queen's bus station. You can, you can go that way around. Fantastic. Right. That will do. What's it going to chuck out now? Okay, so a reasonable amount of people for Saturday. Oh, hang on, I've clicked confirm. Right, no. 
Edit the timetable, there we go. Right, so we're going to go at 5.02. Single deckers. Until, how long is it going to take to get round? How on earth does it take two hours to get round? That's ridiculous. Woodlane Terminus. Woodlane Terminus, right, okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That can be the, uh, the Terminus there, Woodlane. Right, so if we've got that, 40 minutes in. Add 3 minutes, 20 minutes in. So then at 110. And at 90. And then 70 should be about there. Yeah, lovely. Right, okie dokie. So that will be 2302. That's ridiculous. 2202. Every hour. Monday to Friday. Copy that. Right. So Saturday will be... There. Sunday. Every half hour. There we go. And then, right, so hang on, what's that going to be? 502, so we'll go for 622. Until 1922, there we go. Every hour. And then 642. There we go. So it'll be every 20 minutes till 1942. That's fantastic. I mean, I can't see what's wrong with that. Every 20 minutes. And then every hour into the evenings. Should be fine. I say should. Right, have I got everything Saturday, Sunday? That's absolutely brilliant. Right. Let's go for it. Run out of Liverpool Depot. We're going to need more bus drivers, aren't we? I, uh, I can feel that. Right, let's go on to the uh, the old shift schedule. Right, Liverpool. Not enough drivers. There we go. Right, let's go to Liverpool Depot. Hire more staff. Just the friendly ones. The friendliest of the friendly. Tell you what, we'll hire them as well. Because they've got a tiny little bit of skill. No oh, bus manufacturer. Oh, don't say they've recalled... Uh, right, we've found a critical fault in all of our buses. B5LH, right, Gemini 2, no. We only have three, though, right, okay. Where are they? Right, what are you doing? Right, we'll have to find... Yeah, remove the shifts. 22 hours, that's ridiculous. Right, two. Where's the third one? Anyone see the third one? I didn't think we'd sent any Gemini 2s to other depots. I mean, I'm just sort of looking round now. Just going round and round and round. Right, let's have a look. Runcorn. Is there a Gemini 2 sat here? No. You've not sent one here when you were short of buses? No. But well, there is that sat there. Can we get a, can we get a nice livery? No. Nope. Oh, hang on. No, nope, that's East Yorkshire. Right, hang on. Must be very annoying for CG Skins if uh, if he has actually been painting the buses. Because obviously these are all recorded in advance at the moment. Right, hang on. Instead of whizzing through, why don't I just... What happens if you don't take it back? Does the bus explode? Ah, there we go. Right, send to the manufacturer. Right, okay. So, if we go on to our, uh, our shift schedule... We have enough drivers. Liverpool does not have enough buses. Tarvin does, Runcorn does, Wrexham does. Wrexham usually doesn't. So this is an interesting one. Right, there we go. You have enough buses. Except you don't. Right, so Liverpool 2. Right, the 138. Have we assigned any shifts to the 138? We have pulses there, look. Uh, that would... So I would argue there. How about then that's a double-decker on there. Right, okay. Let's buy new buses. Solo buses. Right, Pulsar. How many can we buy for our money? 299. Right, we can't buy seven. We can buy six, though, so that's good. That will do. Right, we'll buy six of them. No! Cancel the purchase. Go to Liverpool Depot and then buy six. We nearly had a disaster there, didn't we? Right. <laughs> I've done that so many times, I've purchased it for the wrong depot. 
and then had to send them all empty stock. Right, where are we? Right, pulse of one. I'm sure it was round here. There we go. Right, six of the damn things. That'll do. Unbonded windows. Get them bought. There they are, down the end. Are they? Really far down the end. Lovely, lovely stuff. Right, okie dokie. Now. How have we still not got... Right. Apply the drivers. Automatically assign. That'll do. Right, okay. So that's good. We're looking a little bit more. I mean, we've currently got a couple of tours and 137s that are not covered. But it's not the end of the world. We can we can easily do this, can't we? This is, uh, this is fine. Right. Need a couple more buses. I've sent you the buses. Oh, because you've not repaired them. That's why. Can I say, stop squawking at me. I've, I've done what I needed to do. Right, there's no research. I keep keep looking at the research. Be interesting to see how the travel centre copes. I mean, I can close... I'm going to close these desks because it's a Saturday. We've got the... Uh, yeah, we're still 8am, 8pm. We'll close those desks and if needs be, we'll open new ones, yeah? Six six seven eight is sat down there, doing its thing. Hopefully not doing anything. Oh no, it has to go out. No, well, never mind. Fuel price change. I'm not a lover of that, you know. Not a lover at all. I like nice cheap fuel. Right, let's have a look. What's happening with Liverpool Depot then? So it's Saturday, so the first bus will be the six, something or other. Yeah, it just won't have that that early morning one on a sun on a, on a Sunday on a Saturday. Where are we now? Should be due out anytime soon, because they like to come out ridiculously early, don't they, and sit there for uh, for a while. Now you see, on a Saturday, I don't think we'll because Saturdays seem to build slowly, don't they? They seem to start off really quiet, and then by the end of the night, all the buses have been mental. Right, that's a one three six. See how we go in. Yeah, you're going in there, that's fine. Oh, it's 5am! Right, where are you going? You're on the... You're a 5.30, lovely. So yeah, half an hour's time, we should have another bus popping out. I hope it's a pulse, though. Right, what are you doing? You're doing a... You're doing a 137, so you'll be going... Yeah, you'll be going down there. Right, you're on a B1. Excellent. Also going down there. Quite a few that run empty stock, isn't there? Where are you going? You'll be going up there. 133. L1. You're on an L2. Lovely. This must be it. Aha! 138. Right. Not actually sitting in the bus station as long as I thought he would. Well, we've got one passenger on. That makes the entire operation worthwhile. Oh, quite a few. Oh, we go up this road just for a little bit more coverage. We really are going to need a lot of routes to get to 90% coverage on this uh, on this particular series, aren't we? Not busy. Not busy at all. Right, okay. Mind you, 7am on a Saturday. What was I expecting? We'll have 10 minutes sat at the terminus. Right, there we go. Are we, uh, right, that's, that'll be 20 minutes after us then, won't it? 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Five passengers, that is a miserable amount of passengers. <laughs> we might not need this to be quite as frequent as I uh, as I sort of expected. Yeah, we, we really don't need this to be as frequent as I uh, anticipated here, do we? Right, 
Wow. Well, the good news is, is that we don't need to buy a whole shed load of buses, do we? Seems to be taking its time to get down here, doesn't it? Yeah, this is the only bit that I sort of foresee being a little bit busy. Oh, there you go, look. This last tiny little stretch into uh, into the bus station. And then after that, nubbed it. Oh, okay, 30 odd. Right, back on quiet. Right, now we've got a lot of people in here apparently, so let's uh, let's open some desks. This is actually really, really good. I mean, willingness of the population to use public transport is up at 66%. I think that's the highest it's been in any of my games ever. 110 minutes, right, okay. Let's uh, let's get these open, people. Come on, drag yourself out of the uh, out of the staff room. I mean, nobody's. Uh, where are where are the staff? Do we have to drag them in from home? Oh, I sent a lot of staff on holiday, didn't I? Because I said it's the end of the uh, the city festival. This is not good. Have we not got any more staff? Ah, there we go. Right, people are here. I thought it was going to go quiet. Well, you know what thought did. Right, another one on duty. Stress through the roof there. Oh, no, 90 minutes. Come on, let's let's get it dealt with people. And of course, someone else has to go on a training course, didn't they? I think it might have been a tad dramatic opening them. Right, we'll close them. Right, have we got anybody for the L2? No, of course we don't, otherwise it would have assigned it earlier. Right, there's no bus driver. Right, hire more bus drivers. Right, everyone needs a locker. Excellent. Right, that can go out. It's the L2, so it's a single decker run. You can be an MMC. How's that? Yeah, we, we really are quite short staffed at the moment. 120 minutes, two hours just to buy a ticket. Oh no! This isn't going to help the uh, the whole the whole rating. Yeah, service centre ticket prices are quite high apparently. Give over, like hell they are. Yeah, day 54, our rating's going down. 150 minutes. Oh, two and a half hours. 160 minutes. Right, we need to draft in emergency help then, don't we? Service employees. Oh, we need more lockers. Disaster. Right, hang on. How can there not be a bus driver? I've just hired three. If we've got anyone at Runcorn that can take it out. No! What about you? You're already assigned. Oh dear. Right. Right, well we need to we need to do something with the locker situation. Right, hang on, corridor. Build a load more of that. Lovely. I really wish you could change the uh, the locker colour to something other than this awful green. Time is running out. Right, there we go. Get those lockers in. Time is not running out because it's paused. Right, so, staff, hire, service employees, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. And then another really friendly one. That'll do. Right, get ten of them in. Bus drivers, yeah, three, four, one, no. Nope. That'll do. Nice, friendly people. Right, get all these desks covered with an additional ten people. How's that? Right, let's go back to the uh, assigning this. Right, give him a job. Where have we... Uh, have we got a double-decker? Right, no. We'll send that thing then. Send an MMC. That'll do. Right, all our new staff. Come on, have we... Uh, oh, you need to go to your locker, don't you? L2, right. Yep, yeah, still nobody here. To do that. Oh, that needs to be fixed. Right, never mind. How is there no bus driver? I've just hired a load. Where have they all gone? 
Is it just me that doesn't understand this game mechanic of I've hired like six staff and they've all disappeared? Is it because they're. Oh, right, people seem to be coming into it. Oh, hang on, what's going on here? Right, it's a bit of a toilet shortage. Right, well, this is a. Uh, right. Delete all of this. Everyone's queuing for the loo, aren't they? Right, so we'll, we'll delete that and put a new bathroom in. Where is it? Bathroom. Right, we'll go one, two, three. There we go. Load of new, new cubicles. They have to be so long and thin if you're not uh, familiar with this game. Because uh, otherwise they don't shut the doors when they go for a sit down. That's pretty much it. They're uh, they're into their voyeurism in the, in this particular game. Right, bathroom sink. Yeah, lovely. Couple of them on the wall. That'll do. And then toilets. I can't see toilet. There we go. Right. Them. There we go. Right. Toilets. Go use them instead. There we go. Anyone who needs a loo. Right. Plenty of people on the desks. We've got that down to 110 minutes. That's good stuff. Got it down to 90. Oh, look at that. We're finally dealing with all the... Tell you what, we'll get these desks open just while we've got an enormous amount of people. I don't know if we've got enough staff to actually man those desks, but we'll just open them all anyway. Got it down to 80 minutes. I think that's something we're going to have to take a bit more of a uh, proactive, you know, sort of opening and closing desks as we need to. You know, busy times, open a few more desks. Don't just leave it. To sort of deal with it a little bit better. But it, it does feel like it doesn't gradually get busier, does it? It's like a coach load of people. Almost like one of my double decker buses drops 100 people off and goes, there you go. £100,000 in the bank. That is good. A lot of people eating, isn't there? You just hear the munching. I don't get why people don't chill out more. You know, it's, uh, it, I, I don't get why all of them are so stressed. You know, if they have an hour break, their stress level should go down. Jason Banner. Just been stopped. Oh, no. No, accept the penalty. I'm not falling for that again. What's four grand? Last time I tried to, uh, on the East Yorkshire Joe Plus exclusive series, we uh, on the Scarborough series, I tried to bribe someone for a Gemini and they actually seized the bus. So it's cheaper to pay four grand than potentially have a 60 grand bus taken off you. Oh, dear. Alright, let's have a look. Oh, broken buses. Yeah, there's quite a few of them, isn't there? <laughs> Quite a few. Right, oil. Let's get that fixed. Indicator. I haven't looked at these in a while. Wiper. Omnicity. What are you needing? You need some oil. Omnicity there needs an indicator fixing. Indicator and light. Oh, why? The solo's broken. I didn't think the solos went out on anything. Literally didn't think we had... Uh, we didn't use them for anything. Are they just? Is it because they're just seizing up? Because they've not been used in so long. Right, we've got the uh, the wiper there. Indicator. It's amazing how much stuff breaks while you're uh, while you've not got your eye on the ball. Right. There we go. That'll do. Well, we've got it down to 70 minutes of waiting time. Looking forward to all our staff coming back off their holiday. Perhaps rather silly of me, and I'm sure that there'll have been many of you in the last episode that will have probably been sat there shaking your head thinking that was a silly thing to do. Well, yeah, it's finally caught up with us. Oh, hang on. Right, that's an annoyance. Right. What was it that wasn't in a drivable state? Oh, I meant to do that thing in Liverpool, didn't I? No? Where are my buses? Right, hang on. Conditions. Is that it? No. Ah, wiper needs sorting. Right, start that repair. MMC. 
roots it needs repairing. You don't get many of them broken, do you? Let's go through Wrexham, make sure. Yeah, Wrexham's fleet is uh, it's still, still fine. That's fine, right, get that done. Tarvin Depot, everything is fine here. Right, 35 minutes left. 30 minutes. What did we achieve anyway? I'd, I'd heard that we'd achieved something. It was probably the 12 maintenance is, wasn't it? That is a lot of lockers, isn't it? Down to 30 minutes. I wonder how the, uh, how's this new route, the 138, doing? 1800, okay, 20 passengers. There's a few people on it then, eight going the other way. Yeah, there's, there's just not the need, is there? So what we're going to do is we're going to go into the timetable, and we're going to change that. So the 138, Sunday, is going to be every hour. Yep, yeah, sorry about that. Saturday... So that'll be, right, that's fine. Monday to Friday. That can be 6.32 to 19.32. 18.32 even, we're going to cut that back. That can go in the bin. Saturday, 6.02, 6.32. So they will be every half an hour and then just every hour. We'll leave it at half an hour. I won't cut it back to every hour. But, uh, yeah, it's not required, is it? I thought that there'd be quite a bit more, you know, with round here. But, no, quiet route. That's absolutely fine. In the uh, in the old research panel, because that seems to be the only place we can actually see it. Where are we? Research. Nearly at 50% coverage. That is quite good. We do need to save up, however. I mean, to be fair, hang on a second. Hang on a cotton-picking second. We've got £200,000. So we could nip over to Warrington and put a depot in and have sort of all round here. That would be quite good. I like that. Right, okay. Let's let's do it. Right. Another depot. Is there a limit to how many we can have, I wonder? Right, that's going to cost a lot of money. So we're going to go for just a terrible little... Ah, oh, lovely. That'll do. So depot 5 can be Warrington Depot. We have no buses there currently, obviously. Uh, we will aim to do something with that in the next episode, which is actually very exciting because I now go on holiday after, I mean, what day is it today? It's Sunday the 19th, so I go on holiday on Wednesday. And, uh, and, and I, yeah, Sunday the 19th of May. Obviously, by the time this goes out, this will be quite a few. I'll nearly be coming back, which is quite sad. Right, this is fine. Close these desks. We don't need these anymore. I think we'll just leave these. I mean, it's Sunday tomorrow, isn't it? Right, close these. Sunday should be quieter. That's what I'm. Uh, that's what I'm hoping for, anyway. Right, let's try and get the broken buses fixed. He's gone on a mission, hasn't he? So, uh, right, he's having his oil done. You can have your oil done. You're in the depot, right? Okay. What do you need? You need your brake pads doing. You need your indicator doing. You're having your indicator done, lovely. You need your oil changing. You're driving a shift. That will do. Right, well, that is where we are going to leave it for today, ladies and gentlemen. I do hope that you have enjoyed today's video. Please do click that like button if you have. And if you want to keep up with the series, if you want to make sure that you don't miss out on our new Warrington expansion that will be coming next time, uh, do make sure that you subscribe so you never miss out on any of that excitement. We'll give him a holiday. There we go. Other than that, thanks so, so much for watching, and, uh, and hopefully I shall see you all next time. Cheerio! Goodbye for now.